Hello everybody and good Saturday morning to you all. Hello Chunky, how are you doing? How's things mate? Contacting Wendy servers, it looks like everything's working today so... Thought I'd jump on for a quick hour or so this morning. What time is it? 20 past 9. I'm out of coffee! It's a disaster. The world is going to end. So yeah, I'm going to have a quick tinker about on this and then I'm going to go and grab myself some new beans. Alright, oh, we're up to level 6, look. Actually, thinking about it, I mean, we did quite a, a long, well, a long session, over an hour yesterday. I think we only went from, like, level 5 to 6. So I'm not convinced I'm playing the game completely wrong. What's this then? Oh, messages. You have one item waiting for you at the postmaster in the tower. Let's go and have a look at that then. Postmaster. Oh, hang on a sec. Oh, that's alright. But the stream had uh, gone down. Chunky, can you uh, hear me, mate? Let me check Moobot as well. And me bots all right, isn't it? Oh yes, you can. You just bought a state of decay and the breakdown DLC for Tekla five book seventy three. Oh wow, nice one, dude. You know what, mate? I was really close to um, buying the state of decay DLC, and I, I don't know. It was really unlike me. Um, I just decided not not to opt for it. In fact, I ended up booting up the original state of decay and just having a little tinker about in that. I think what annoys me most is it's such a, a crappy port in terms of graphical fidelity. So obviously I run it with sweet effects which makes it look pretty good actually. Um, the problem is is the way that sweet FX works as an injector you can't stream it unless I play it like say in a windowed mode or something. Holy crap! Hello Mimi! <laughs> How you doing, man? How's Oz? How's the other side of the planet? Hello, CM. Happy Saturday morning to you guys. Oh, wow. Ch oh, good. Oh, wow. I'm a uh, third person, though. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, this game is going to be absolutely awesome. Alright, so I think level 9 is the cap. Look at that dude over there with his uh, Fiz -ex, Fiz -ex. uh oh man. Welcome Hunter. Cade 6, the mentor of new hunters arriving in the tower, can help you with some equipment. Let's have a chat with the postmaster. Checking. Oh! Uh, delivers a message is left for the postmaster to be collected by guardians when their travels bring them home. Thank you for helping us test destiny. This is our alpha test. Make sure everything holds up. In the heavy load, we couldn't do it without you. Oh, thanks, Bungie. So that gave me a hundred, whatever they are. Is that glimmer or something else, do you think? Options. Inventory. Yeah, that's Glimmer. So we've got Glimmer. What are these then? Vanguard marks can be used to purchase legendary weapons. Okay, I wonder if that's... Uh... Right, so I'm guessing Crucible marks are some kind of PvP currency. Vanguard marks... I don't know how you get them. Maybe from killing the bosses, possibly? We've got these. There's definitely some element of... Crafting, possibly? Consumables. Cloth banners that record house history in monofilament wires. Always of interest to the crypt arc. Okay. Mission. Warping claws. Taken from defeated thrall. Return these to your vanguard mentor. Okay, yeah, cool. It, it, it is very definitely MMO light, isn't it? It's. I, I think Bungie might really be onto something here, you know. 36,506 inches, less than a tenth of a degree <laughs> <to> <laughs> Still the same with its slow internet, maybe, yeah. Huh. Everything significant. All these... Deep and dead 
ocean signaling all the while. And we, the first to crack it. Right. It sounded a little bit like, um, what's his name? Liam Nielsen, is it? You've been waiting for State of Decay to hit five bucks. Oh, well, it's a cracking game, Chunky. You'll have uh, a good time with that. What have you been uh, playing then, Mimi? Oh, look, we get 200 for exchanging that artifact then. Out of the house banners. So we'll accept that, I suppose. Seems to make sense. Oh! Each engram decoded sheds light on lost history. Ooh. It's a heavy weapon and a special weapon. Go for the special. Oh, maybe we can use them all. Oh, cool. Can we see what that is? No. We'll just do them all then. Ooh. Christ. Bit early in the morning for this. Um, let's have a look then. So, mate, right, let's go to our inventory. Let's have a quick look. Ah, now what I wanted to—I know something I didn't do yesterday. I didn't upgrade my skills, did I? Um, throw an eye from a distance. See how many skills have I got, or do you just automatically get it when the bar is full? Path forgotten. Training focus on toughness and speed. Oh wow, look at the difference that makes to my armor and agility. Oh wow, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, because yesterday I was kind of hesitant to put a point in these because I was thinking like, you know, how they typically work where you, you know, you gain a level, you gain a skill point and then you have to choose where you put them. It doesn't work like that, does it? Which is really nice actually. You just gain experience, don't you? Which is these sort of like incompleted green circumference areas and then it looks like so with the grenades presumably as I use grenades I will gain experience as I jump around presumably as I use my uh, golden gun skill etc yeah I like that that's a good system so let's have a look at the guns uh, semi-automatic oh look at that pulse rifle Oh yeah, let's go for that. What's that bad boy look like? Oh yes! Looking like a boss! wonder if you can customise your weapons. How cool would that be? <gasps> what the fuck? Holy shit, look at that! <laughs> that looks awesome! Oh! Oh, can you... Oh, it's a shame you can't rotate the weapons. That would have been nice. Look, you can upgrade them. Oh, Jesus, that's brilliant. This weapon causes... Oh, so there's no... Spe oh, wow, this game is epic. Oh, I've got a fire and some kind of shock, maybe, do you think? Let's have a look at details. <laughs> Let's stick with this one. Let's have a look at what it does. So this high-powered machine gun, yeah, I like the sound of that. Delivers inertia coupled ram rounds, inflicting extraordinary damage. Every weapon is used purple ammo pickups, hold triangle. Oh, I was about to say, how'd you get it? Because I know uh, triangle, tap triangle is just to switch to your um, secondary weapon. It's a shame I can't use that. Like, shotgun's terrible. Oh. You've been playing Watch Dogs, have you, Mimi? What, on the PC, mate? Or. Look at this stuff for level bloody hell, level seven, I'm gonna be awesome. I like how everything uh does actually have a, a visible impact on your character. It's uh you know it's to be expected oh look, requires level nine. It's to be expected in this day and age, but the hunter's cloak speaks to their personality. You'll go scrounge up this out some look. Where the fuck is my cloak? I haven't got one. <laughs> What's going on? Lying to me, look. Right, okay. Oh, God, this game, mate. How 
Hello, Chisida, I saw you boot up Borderlands 2 earlier and I, I so nearly dropped you a quick message just to say hello. And I thought I, I wouldn't interrupt you. How are you doing? I've missed you. Holy crap, Lef, how are you doing, buddy? How's the wonderful world of game development, mate? See you later, Mimi. Look after yourself, man. What time is it there in Australia, dude? Oh, view map. Oh, Jesus, look at all this. Hey, I'll tell you what. This is... This is uh, oh, wow. I've, I'm quite overwhelmed, actually. It's... Uh, I was, I was happy with what I saw yesterday and now with these like sort of um, social hunts as well this is going to be absolutely fantastic isn't it hey who's come on who's going to get this with me we need to get a clan or some guild or whatever the fuck they're called in this game go in yo 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 rockers <laughs> how you doing buddy oh I've missed you too just seeing honestly mate I'm so glad you've popped by, even if it's a, a, a quick stream or, or you've got things to do. We need to we need to get playing together. We need to find a new game. So this is interesting, look. Now I've pre-ordered this game, and apparently I get something called a Red Sparrow, which apparently is a slightly upgraded version of the one that I would uh, typically start with. So these. So you need a Vanguard rank 1 look. So I'm not sure how you get your Vanguard rank. That's interesting. So I'm kind of guessing Vanguard is the PvE element of the game. Um, if anyone knows, feel free to shout out because I ain't got a clue. I've kind of been on a bit of a media blackout on the game. But having said that, I don't think they've really released a lot, have they? And you've been quite quiet on it. I know they're really, really trying to... Um, steer the media away from calling it an MMO, aren't they? Um, and in fairness, it's not an MMO, but it is, it's definitely got elements, wow, check that out, of an MMO game. It's Tuesday afternoon in Australia. What the fuck? <laughs> it can't be Tuesday afternoon in Australia. It's any fucking Saturday. <laughs> Surely not, Chunky. Sure, surely not. Jesus Christ, you've just completely uh, blown my mind there. I tell you, I've, oh, I watched um, Paul yesterday. You know the film with Simon Pegg and his uh, his I can't remember his friend's name. Eh? And uh, they're in America. And they go to that the uh, median line and they're jumping back and forth. And Paul's sitting there going, "It's kind of like time travel." <laughs> Absolutely wicked film. Uh, to, to, to be honest, Junkie, I only, I only booted uh, partly because you sounded like you'd had enough, mate, and I thought we'd try and try and get a few of the old.